go. All right, guys. I bought this new 2020 GMC. There's not a whole lot on YouTube about how to reprogram keys. And it got a little frustrating. So I went and got a new transmitter to match my old transmitter. Okay, because the dealership only gave me one. Now, they were gonna charge me $200 to do this. So, I'm not gonna walk through the steps, like showing the steps, but I will show y'all what the process requires. So, first off, you're gonna take your key and you're gonna insert it into your door. You will take this key and you will turn it one, two, three, four, five times counterclockwise in 10 seconds. Once that's done, on your display inside here, it will say remote key learn. It'll give you step-by-step -step instructions of when to press the start stop button. This is a push button start truck. There's no need to press the brake. You will just press the start and stop button when you are told. You will do that once, wait 10 minutes, do it again, wait 10 minutes, do it again, wait 10 minutes. Once that happens, on my dash, again, it will say, ready for remote one. You will take your empty new transmitter and you will stick it right down in this cup holder in between these two pockets. I stuck it right here. It only takes about five seconds, and then on the dash, it's gonna say ready for remote two. You take your second remote and you put it there. It takes about five seconds, then it says ready for remote three. When you get into that process and you only have two remotes, and you can program up to eight, but I only had two. So when I got done programming number two, I held my start stop button right here. I held that down for 12 seconds. As soon as I did, that ends the programming and brings the truck back to normal. Now, once that's done, take both of your key fobs, your transmitters, you need to hit lock, unlock and lock on one, hit unlock and lock on the other one, just to test them. When you're done with that, you can then pull your key out, slide it back in your transmitter, and you got two transmitters ready to go. Now, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. They only gave me one, it was kind of a bummer. They have to go buy another one. Just this key by itself uncut was $50. They cut it at the GMC dealership for me. The transmitter was $115 by itself. Now, I'm ready to go. They wanted to charge me $200 extra just to program the keys if anybody has any questions on these i know i didn't video the process on the dash it's literally step by step leave comments ask questions and i'll get back with you uh there's another guy that does it he does it on a couple different vehicles he just doesn't do it on the full-size trucks like mine brand new um it's not simple do not let somebody charge you at the dealership more than what it takes to do it thank you